Hello guys, this is Mayuri from Vidic Academy and this section is devoted to discuss the equation of straight line in slope point form. So now let me prove the formula using a theorem that is the equation of a straight line with slope m and passing through the point x1, y1 is y minus y1 is equal to m into x minus x1. So we already know the equation of a straight line with slope m is y equal to mx plus c according to slope intercept form where m is the slope and c is the y intercept. So it is named this as equation 1 and then given that this line passes through the point x1 comma y1. So as it passes through this point must satisfy the equation 1. So it is right y1 equal to mx1 plus c. And now from this equation we get the value of c as y minus mx1. And now by substituting this value in equation 1 we get y equal to mx plus the value of c which is y1 minus mx1. And then by transferring y1 to the left hand side we get y minus y1 is equal to mx minus mx1 and then from both these terms we can take m as the common factor so that implies we get y minus y1 is equal to m into x minus x1 this is the equation of the line with slope m and containing the point x1 comma y1 and now let us proceed and discuss one example so we need to find the equation of a straight line which makes an angle 120 degrees with x axis and passes through the point minus 2 comma 3. So let us write the given inclination theta is equal to 120 degrees. So using this information we can find the slope of a required line which is given by the formula m is equal to tan theta. So that implies we get here m equal to tan 120 degrees. So tan 120 can be written as tan 180 degrees minus 60 degrees. So as it is in the form of tan 180 minus theta, we get minus tan theta. So here we get minus tan 60 degrees. And the value of tan 60 is root 3. So that implies we get here minus root 3 as the value of m. And given that this line passes through the point minus 2 comma 3. So let us equate P x1 comma y1 with the point minus 2 comma 3. So here we have slope as well as a point. So we can use slope point form to find the equation. That is y minus y1 is equal to m into x minus x1. So that implies we get here y minus y1 which is 3 is equal to m which is minus root 3 into x minus x1 which is minus 2. So that implies we get here y minus 3 is equal to minus root 3 into x plus 2. So that implies we get here y minus 3 is equal to minus root 3x then by multiplying we get minus 2 root 3. And then transferring these terms to the left hand side, we get root 3x plus of y minus 3 and then this becomes plus 2 root 3 is equal to 0. So we can write this equation as root 3x plus y minus of 3 minus 2 root 3 is equal to 0. So this is the equation of a straight line which makes an angle and also passes through the given point and make a note that the equation of a line with slope m and containing a point is given by y minus y1 is equal to m into x minus x1. So this is about slope point form and in our next video we are going to discuss about two point form. So stay tuned. Thanks for watching. Have a nice day.